our first technique in this week's advanced syllabus, we are going to look at, well, it's got various names, um, sometimes called the Super Guard, but uh, I think Scorpion Crunch is the more dramatic and exciting name for it. This is a um, compression attack from inside the closed gun. So we're going to go sideways, I think, to make this a little bit easier. So, uh, but these looking forward to this a lot. Uh, so basically, um, the way this works is I'm going, you know, it, it's perfectly, also to clarify, this is illegal at white belt, it is legal from blue belt onward. So again, in training you are allowed to, if you want, do the thing you bring your feet out and you squeeze your knees into the ribs. Uh, it's unlikely to tap someone, if you're a kid, it, it will probably, you know, it can do that, I've seen kids tap a competition to it, but um, it's usually not enough to actually tap somebody who is, you know, resisting. Also, usually if I just go here, she's usually able to go forwards into it, or you know, go past the point where the knees hit, hit the ribs and cause the real pain. So, what you can do, um, depending on arm length and things like that, obviously it will depend on the size of your partner, but what you can do is, if I, if I open my arm and bring my hand behind, so I'm going to go behind this, I'm going to bring her forwards, I'm going to go under my legs and grab an S grip here, or if I've got longer, if she's smaller, uh, I can go with a Gable grip instead. If you're already at that point and they're that much smaller, uh, you're being mean to people, but that's a separate issue. Most of the time you're going to go with an S grip because that allows you to grip a bit wider than your normal waist. So you bring the person forwards, often with underhooks here, and then you're going to go both arms underneath and S grip here, and your feet go together. I haven't done anything yet, but leave it on up. And then basically you're now going to uh, spike your feet upwards and compress your legs in there. Okay. Now, in this case, actually, because uh, the size, this is that's not as tight as it could be because my knees are just behind her rather than directly on her ribs. But uh, you have a ton of compression power there. Um, again, there's uh, a few examples. This one famous example, viral video um, of. Uh, one athlete throwing up on the other person's head. That does count as a victory, which is good. Um, and yeah, so basically, it's not to say, if I just look at a body triangle, that's you know unpleasant. If you want to turn it into an actual submission, you go for that. Be aware, if someone's older or whatever, this can uh, cause injury, because they go, oh, it's not really a submission. It really is a submission. Not the most technical in the world, but a submission. So you have to respect it. So again, simple enough. Again, catch the under, bring the person forward, arms go behind your knees, and you're gonna go S grip, finger to finger, yeah. And your feet go together, and you just stretch up, spike away. Okay, that is the scorpion crunch or super guard. Uh, I think at some point they call it the scorpion death lock because it sounds cooler than that. But uh, scorpion crunch from closed up.